you not look like storage? Where's storage? It might mean back at the thingy. Oh, right. Oh, yeah, back at the bank. Because <clears throat> you're disequipped. <clears throat> All right, so, Vienna Reptile. The power <laughs> of military radiation military alters... Military radiation. Yeah. Alters one man's life in a very special way. He's cool now. <laughs> Brandon Maggart plays... Let me see here. One second. Man, I wish I could make Bach do funny things like this. Brandon Maggart plays Walter Hibiscus. That's a name. The, the startling star of NBC's Vienna Reptile. He's not from Tokyo, and he hates information. <laughs> what does that mean? But Walter is one of those amazing people who just can't be counterfeit. It says it said counterfeit and radiation related things in two different ones in a row. Um, That's how botnet works. Typically. He's charming, suave, and so straight he can't even look at all the other guys in his car. <laughs> the, yeah, you know the ones in his car. But when the god of rejection has plans for his parents, <laughs> will he get a real job and stop enjoying American Gladiators? I guess. I guess. <laughs> oh, there was a Moke Kong. It's annoying that Unic de equips everything. Yeah, that seems like a little bit of tedium they could have very easily worked around. Vienna Reptile. He's cool now. <laughs> yeah, because of military radiation. Yes. Yeah, I need to find some military radiation. I feel like that's a bad idea. <laughs> but I, I want to be cool. Like, the hibiscus. But actual radiation is actually very hot. Okay, I need that. Yeah, but military radiation, is it? Like Chris, I'm trying to deposit my money. Where's my other? If you have money, you should just sort of manage itself when you're not in a dungeon. So just, because otherwise it's just a bunch of busy work and running. Well, take it up with the developers of Mystery Dungeon games. Or Squenix. No, because it does it in Pokemon Mystery Dungeon too. Dad detective goes to prison. <laughs> Why are there so many detectives? Because it's the 80s. Oh. When detective dad Martin, that's his name. When dad Martin? Yeah, detective dad Martin goes to court to testify against Freddie Lowndes. He ends up in jail forever for his sins. <laughs> what sins? <laughs> he ends up in jail forever. <laughs> That sounds very something. <laughs> but when his wife and kids move into jail with him... <laughs> That's how jail works, right? <laughs> he ends up enjoying prison. <laughs> and of course, a lot of new inmates just join the family too. And these terrifying uncles are moving into an apartment that's really the police academy. <laughs> Plus the warden is in a gang of survivors of lunch surgery. <laughs> oh no! That's tragic. Lunch surgery. Again, it sounds like a bad lip reading sentence. Oh, this crystal. I said start with thief. Oh, okay, why? Because thieves are cute. <laughs> Henshin! No, it's got a cute little bandana. Look oh, at look him. at the knife! Oh, he's got a, he's got a knife. What? No, 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 Jack. So now I can't kick things anymore. Okay, so that's why natural is good, because it can kick things hard. Blind needles could be definitely useful to steal also. Speaking of police shows, Tuesday has Deputy Arizona. That doesn't sound too silly, but I'm sure it will. Um, um, Dad, oh, Dad, by the way, those last two are on Monday. Dad Detective goes to prison, though. I need to watch that now. Yeah. On CBS, a career drifter without a net is on his own. A net? Yeah. I do like this bandana. 
Until a master of lying shoots into his life like a chicken on a Sunday. Again, master of lying sounds like something from bad lip reading. Steal. I miss. Maybe he doesn't have anything. I got a potion. And then he threw a bomb at you for your efforts. For my um, sins? Yep. He's gonna go to prison forever for his sins. Um, but yeah, until a master of lying shoots into his life like a chicken on Sunday. What does that mean? Mm. Deputy Arizona is one man who won't be dead, <laughs> and he hates all the gorgeous people who are. <laughs> What does it mean? He's a real leather jacket of a sheriff who gets t teamed up with a gunfighter who happens to be a famous doctor that everyone already knows about. <laughs> it's one unlikely frontier punch up after another until the lecherous sheriff is forced to fight and kill a captive lion. <laughs> okay. And then there's also I'm sorry, scum. Which is also on Tuesday. Oh, Monday's gonna be fun. Mash was okay. But what about getting a new housekeeper? No problem. Michael Douglas literally has to work for you in the stomach cleaning... In... <laughs> this sentence is confusing a little bit. No problem. Michael Douglas literally has to work for you in the stomach cleaning comedy of errors. I'm sorry, scum. In the magic of Gumption, Ohio, the young Frankenstein is about to force Michael Douglas to be a household assistant by lying about everything, except how, except how to get off. Uh, by lying about everything. <laughs> Sometimes the boss can be a real punk, and Michael Douglas wishes to use his deadly kung fu to take charge. But Frankenstein always manages to work things out. Cooper, <laughs> Cooper Bill and Michael Douglas star in the season's hottest saga and the only series that Fireman wrote on duty. <laughs> that's, I don't think that's how television works. And then Wednesday, Grease and Dogs, American Forever. I'm not liking Thief so far. Oh, Dueling Room. Oops, that was a shop. It seems you can only steal what they'll normally draw. Oh, hi. Well, this might suck. Right. I mean, you could blind him. Or you could actually, like, blind him as well, I guess. I need to read a book. I'm pretty sure you just did that out of range. <laughs> it's fine. It's not. I have another one. There, there we go. You know. Oh, let's fight. Oh, God, look how much damage I'm doing to him. Ow. That was a duel? That was a waste of a blind or two. You got oh. 97 job points, though. That was bizarre. So you're going to level up pretty quick, because I think it's 200 for the first level. I think the Thief actually ranks up slower than the others, at least to start. It had 260, I think, on it. Yeah, that's what I remember. I'm going to steal from the sleeping <coughs> person, which is how thieves typically work, right? You are a lousy thief. Just killing. No. So, Grease and Dogs, American Forever. An astronaut is committed to fighting crime. So here we go again with crime fighting. But it's an astronaut this time. Yep. But an unexpected detour <laughs> through a coma of fortune forces the science cop forces this science cop to experience a typical winter in the medium town of Walnut Bang. That's terrible. A rival Denny's opens across the street from the original Denny's in the town. <laughs> <laughs> Are you okay? No. <laughs> a rival Denny's opens across the street from the original Denny's and the town gets even more wealthy and successful in this powerful new drama brought to you by Denny's. <laughs> Yeah, just, I just get whatever that monster normally carries, it looks, which is really disappointing. Hamburger class in... F ha hamburger class is in for the spaceship investigator, J.C. Langley, 
as he tries to make his way up to manager in one of those Denny's. <laughs> this crime-fighting astronaut? Yep, and then there's also an advertisement here that says, Stick your stoop, stick your soup spoon up your nose and exclaim, No comment, because you're the best. Oh, I'm having a lot of potions, though, so this could actually work. With vitamin C in a perfect world, your skin will feel like teeth. That's the beauty of Crystal Light. Sounds bad. Ooh, what's this? Welcome, Koopa. Why can't I steal money? What if I use steal on the shopkeeper? So what are you carrying now? What is it? I'm not just going to steal every time I'm here. Hey, don't spoilers. Well, I'm trying to see whether it's ever useful. I mean, oh, steal? No, the thief class. Um, you can make it so you can locate all traps, foes, and items in a certain range. You can make it so you won't wake up foes. Yeah. So it's a support class, more or less. Oh yeah, it's the thief. You can steal money from them. That sounds useful. Um, increases the odds of enemy item drops. That's good, but you also can do that by trying to steal from them. You can warp to random location on the same floor, and okay. you can increase your movement speed. The increased movement speed is enormous. In this yeah, trip. move faster for a period of time. It's also level eight, though. Yeah. Yeah. Well, the other class went up to level nine. I'm sure every class gets something. So this is going to be a bit of a grind, I feel. But what do bombs have? I'm going to steal from a bomb. Fire talents. I guess it might be worth trying to steal from bosses. Also dangerous. And if you, you know, disable them first, it might not be. In one way or another. Blind. Plus, plus, like the tortle. He was still kind of a pushover. Oh, he was absolutely a pushover. Wood saddle in the lava well. All right. Psychedelic collar. Well, let's see. What else do we have here? Because I'm getting tons of fire talent. So it's just by killing things. Uh, keen eye collar protects you from blindness. I'd say that's better than protection from forgetting right as I step on a forgetfulness trap. Good. It was all planned out. Yeah. Oh, the hunger traps and the unhunger traps look identical. That's really malicious. Alright, boat names by Botnik. A little dab dab a do dabblin. Mental jail. Sh Shrimp and crescendo. Botnik is probably best for complete dance. Yeah, because you get more because chance for the sentence to enforce itself. Anyone can just string a bunch of random words together. Let's see here. <laughs> a review of the Statue of Liberty. <laughs> I have experienced the Statue of Liberty for the only time. <laughs> the boat ride is nice, but took over five minutes to even reach the statue. <laughs> That's terrible! I had a few options. I can go into the pedestal and just admire the tickets I had prepaid for. I can read on Liberty and Ellis Island. I can sit inside the boat and just smile. <laughs> this is a real conundrum. Five minutes, oh no. I have been too many things in the dead heat of time. I guess I can get good in the freezing cold of the raindrops. The statue itself was a little confused and kind of just stood there. <laughs> Statues are wont to do. We waited maybe ten minutes before getting hit with a major bummer. The Statue of Liberty was just a ripoff of the Statue of Weather. <laughs> I didn't know this! Did you? <laughs> Why is there a crown on the Statue of Liberty? It was insanely hot, and I was so pissed off I just wanted to buy a boat and just pay for it for a while. 
<laughs> or pay for it for a while. Yeah. <laughs> the statue is cool to get hungry in. You get hungry in the majestic statue without getting wet. Even though we got se even though we got separated and never made it out of the statue. <laughs> We're still there. I am 